Welcome to the Spoken Tutorial on Merging and Deleting Branches. In this tutorial, we will learn about Merging, Revert Merging and Deleting Branches. For this tutorial, I am using Ubuntu Linux 14.04, Git 2.3.2 and Gedit Text Editor. You can use any editor of your choice. To follow this tutorial, you must have knowledge of basics of git commands and branching in git. If not, for relevant Linux tutorials, please visit our website. Earlier in the series, we learned to create branches. Now, we will learn how to merge two branches. This diagram illustrates how the new module branch is merged with the master branch. This is done in the C9 commit. After merging, the commits of new module are added to master branch. Let me explain how it works. First, we will open our git repository, my web page, which we created earlier. Press Ctrl Alt T to open the terminal. To go into our git repository, type cd space my web page and press enter. I will continue to use HTML files for demonstration. You may use any file type of your choice. From here onwards, please remember to press the enter key after typing every command on the terminal. Let us check the git branch list by typing git space branch. We can see that we have two branches named master and new chapter. The new chapter branch was created earlier in this series and master is the default branch. Currently, we are in the master branch. We will check the git log by typing git space log space hyphen hyphen one line. Let's go to new chapter branch and check the git log. Type git space checkout space new chapter. Type git space log space hyphen hyphen one line. Now we will compare the commits of master and new chapter branches. These four commits are common to both the branches. Added story.html in new chapter branch is in new chapter branch. And added chapter 2 in history.html is in master branch. After merging, added story.html in new chapter branch commit will be added in the master branch. Let me demonstrate how to merge now. Type git space merge space master. Gedit opens up automatically to receive the commit message. Recall that we have configured Gedit as the core editor of git. If you had configured another editor, then that one will open up. If you are using a git version that is below 1.9, then the editor may not open. So, you may skip the next step. I use the default commit message as it is. If you want to give any other message related to the merging, then type it here. Now, save and close the editor. We will check the git log again. You can see that the commits of master branch are merged with new chapter branch. You can also see a commit message for the merging. Next, we will go to master branch and check the commits. Type git space checkout space master. Let's check the git log. Here, we should have seen master branch commits along with new chapter commits. But the git log shows master branch commits only. Ideally, we should have merged the new chapter branch to the master branch. But we have merged it the other way around. That's why we can't see the merging commit in the master branch. So, how can we revert this merging? For this, we will have to go back to the new chapter branch. Type git space checkout space new chapter. To revert the merge, type git space reset space 
hyphen hyphen hard space head tilde. Recall that latest revision is always head and latest minus one revision is always head tilde. So we have used head tilde to get the previous revision of merging. Let's check the git log once again. We can see that the merging is discarded now. We will now merge the new chapter branch to the master branch. We will go to master branch first by typing git space checkout space master. Let's check the git log again. To merge, we will type git space merge space new chapter. Give your merging commit message in the gedit. Then save and close the editor. Again check the git log. We can see that our new chapter branch has been successfully merged to the master branch. Let's try to merge it again. Type git space merge space new chapter. Now we see a message that says already up to date. This is a good way to verify whether we merged or not. After merging, the new chapter branch can be deleted from the git repository. To delete the branch, type git space branch space hyphen d space new chapter. Let's check the branch list once again by typing git space branch. We can't see new chapter branch anymore as it has been deleted. To delete a branch without merging, use hyphen d in uppercase instead of hyphen d in lowercase. With this, we come to end of this tutorial. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we have learnt about merging, revert merging and deleting branches. As an assignment, check the commits of the branch chapter 2 which we created in the previous assignment. Merge it with the master branch and delete the chapter 2 branch. The video at the following link summarizes the Spoken Tutorial project. Please download and watch it. The Spoken Tutorial project team conducts workshops and gives certificates to those who pass online tests. For more details, please write to us. Spoken Tutorial project is funded by NMEICT, MHRD, Government of India. More information on this mission is available at the following link. This is Priya from IIT Bombay. Thanks for joining.